Welcome back to another episode of Demystifying Medicine. With the recent rise in popularity of fad diets, we would like to focus on the positives and negatives associated with vegan diets. Veganism refers to people who choose not to consume any animal products, eggs, and dairy. Among others, the main reason that people decide to go vegan is the health benefits associated with it. Plant-based products are lower in calories and therefore vegans tend to eat fewer calories compared to other diets. A study done in 2018 by Dr. Kalova and her colleagues tried to look at the effects of vegan diet on BMI. In the study, they assigned a vegan or controlled diet to 75 overweight people without diabetes. They followed these adults for a span of 16 weeks. Blood samples were analyzed throughout the study and it was found that the vegan group had a 65.5% increase in the beta cell glucose sensitivity, which means insulin secretion increased compared to the control group. This showed that the plant-based products greatly improve the beta cell function, which can help diabetics respond to spikes in blood glucose levels. It was found that the BMI of adults in the vegan group dropped by two points. However, the BMI of the control group stayed the same. Cardiovascular diseases are the number one cause of death globally. Approximately 18 million people died from cardiovascular diseases in 2016. Eating habits play an important role in determining the risk of cardiovascular diseases. Plant-based products have been found to be beneficial to the heart as they contain no dietary cholesterol, abundant fiber, and very little saturated fats. Therefore, researchers from the Physicians Committee for Responsible Medicine in Washington decided to look at the effects of vegan diet on cardiovascular system. They collected information from several clinical trials and observational studies in regards to the effects of plant-based products on humans' cardiovascular system. They found out that the risk of coronary heart disease was reduced by approximately 40%, and hypertension risk was also dropped by approximately 34%. One of the main reasons that plant-based products were able to reduce the risk of heart disease was due to the fact that they are rich in fiber and phytonutrients, and this leads to reduction in inflammation and oxidative stress. However, there are two sides to every coin. Despite the health benefits associated with veganism, it is important to take into account that this diet lacks some essential nutrients. This includes N3 polyunsaturated fats, vitamin D, iron, vitamin B12, and zinc, for example. In terms of iron, recommendations for iron consumption amongst vegans is about 1.8 times higher than non-vegans. This is mainly because iron in food occurs in two different types of forms, heme iron and non-heme iron. Heme iron is mainly found in meat, poultry, and fish. On the other hand, non-heme iron is found in vegetables, grains, and nuts, and is unfortunately less well-absorbed in comparison to heme iron sources. It was found that 92% of individuals who followed a vegan diet and avoided the consumption of animal products, eggs, and milk experienced a B12 deficiency. There are several risks associated with people with vitamin B12 deficiency, and those include impaired brain function, neurological, and psychiatric disorders. It is important to note that vegan diets are not recommended for pregnant women, lactating women, and children due to the possibility of acquiring a vitamin B12 deficiency. In pregnant women, a lack of B12 can lead to adverse health effects, such as preterm delivery, low birth weight, and ne neural tube effects. In addition, DHA is a significant omega-3 fatty acid that is not present in most vegan diets. Deficiency in DHA could have a serious effect on mental health and brain development, especially in children and infants. It has been found that DHA deficiency in pregnant women could lead to some serious impacts in fetal brain development. DHA could be made from omega-3 fatty acid ALA, which is found in high amounts in walnut and flax seeds. However, this conversion is extremely inefficient and is not enough. Furthermore, vitamin D is an essential vitamin in our body. However, most of the foods that are high in vitamin D come from animals. A study done by Applebee in 2016 found out that vegan diets increased the risk of osteoporosis and it showed bone mineral density was 4% lower in vegan diets. It is important that those who decide to go into vegan diets supplement their diets accordingly. For iron deficiencies, in order to avoid such a deficiency, vegans are recommended to consider fortified foods and iron supplements. Also, pairing high iron foods with ingredients that are high in vitamin C will enhance your body's ability to absorb iron. Some of these examples include kiwi, strawberries, and broccoli. To avoid B12 deficiencies, vegans should consume B12 fortified foods, which may include soy and rice beverages, breakfast cereals, or a daily vitamin B12 supplement. For DHA deficiencies, people with vegan diets are recommended to take supplements in the form of algal oil, which comes from a certain type of microalgae. To avoid vitamin D deficiencies, vegans are recommended to take vitamin D3 supplements. 
As a result, vegan diets reduce the risk of cardiovascular diseases, unhealthy BMI, and type 2 diabetes. However, iron, vitamin B12, and vitamin D, and DHA of deficiencies are common amongst vegan diets. Therefore, it is extremely important for vegans to take supplements in order to cope with these deficiencies. Before making drastic changes in your diet, please consult with your family physician and dietitian to see if this lifestyle change is something for you to consider.